Is your volume too low on Windows? Maybe you've turned the volume way up and still can't hear a thing. This is a common and infuriating problem with Windows, and several things could be causing it. So let's run through a few basic troubleshooting tips. First, let's check the volume mixer. Windows sets volume differently for each program or application. Sometimes it will set the volume for a particular program lower than it should be. Look for the volume icon in the system tray. Then right click the icon and select open volume mixer. Use the sliders to increase each application to the max volume setting or to your desired volume setting. This is the most obvious fix for low volume applications. If it didn't work for you, let's move on to some of the other likely issues. Check your speakers, jacks and connections. Depending on the age and quality of your speakers and PC, they may simply be failing. The fault could lie in several places. You should check your cables, speakers or headphones, input jacks and any other auxiliary connections. If at all possible, try using a second playback device to figure out whether it's the speakers at fault or the computer. If your PC has Bluetooth, connect to a Bluetooth speaker and see if the audio output is fine. In this case, it's likely a faulty jack or connection that's the problem. Your PC may have more than one audio jack on the front and the back. If so, try connecting your speakers to an alternative jack and see if that fixes the issue. If the speaker uses a USB port instead, try a different USB port. You can also try using the speakers on another PC or device. If they work with that device, it's the PC at fault. Your next best option is to run the Windows Audio Troubleshooter. The Windows Audio Troubleshooter provides a handful of common audio problem fixes. If you're lucky, running this troubleshooter will solve your volume problems immediately. First look for the volume icon in the system tray. Then right click the volume icon and select Troubleshoot Sound Problems. In the wizard that opens, select your audio device from the list then follow the instructions step by step to run through some possible fixes. Of course, the troubleshooter may not detect any issues. So if it doesn't work for you, let's move on to the next thing you can try. Let's make sure that Windows is using the correct playback device. Windows might be running your audio through the wrong device. In the system tray, right click the volume icon and then select sounds. Under output, find your audio device, usually speakers, headphones, or your sound card. Now, select your preferred output device from the list. If the incorrect device was selected, you should now be hearing sound at the right volume through the correct speakers. If these basic troubleshooting steps don't work for you, check out the article linked in the description below for more advanced help. See you next time.